Oh, well, I've had a good innings. This regeneration, it's a bit of a clerical error anyway. Gotta go sometime. Not with me! Die with whoever comes after me. You do not leave me! Ty, I need to talk to you just on your own. Listen to me. We all have to face death eventually, be it ours or someone else's. I'm not ready yet. I don't want to think about that, not yet. I can't change what's already happened. There are rules. So break them. And anyway, you owe me. You've made yourself essential to me. You've given me something else to... to be. And you can't do that and then die. It's not fair. Clara. No. Doctor, I don't care about your rules or your bloody survivor's guilt. If you love me in any way, you'll come back. Doctor, you... I can't save Moran or Pritchett. No, like you said, if you can... If you can find out why this is happening, then maybe you can stop them killing anybody else. You can save us. And you can stop it happening to you. I'll do what I can. But the future has already happened. We've just met the Undertaker and he's still alive. You've got a better view than me. How do I look? Any signs of trauma? Any scars? Any clues as to how I die? No, nothing. You're the same as all the other ghosts with the weird black eyes and... No. No, wait. Your coat. It's torn, the right shoulder. I, I assume that I'm just saying the same thing as the others. No. You're saying a list of names, our names mainly. Moran, Pritchard, Prentice, O'Donnell, Clara, Doctor, Bennett, Cass. Who's Prentice? The mole-faced chap. What's the matter, Clara? What's happening? You've moved inside. You're inside here now. What am I doing? Uh... Nothing. You're, you're, you're just standing there. I'm not trying to kill you. Why, why am I not trying to kill you? No, wait, you're moving. You're going toward the control panel. <laughs> oh, no. He's opening the Faraday cage. He's let the other ghosts out. Clara, I need to talk to me now. But didn't you hear me? You just opened the Faraday cage. The other ghosts are outside. Shouldn't we be hiding? In a minute. I need to talk to the ghost me. Okay. Doctor, you're on. Doctor. Such an honor. I've always been a huge admirer. This is really a delight. Finally, someone worth talking to. So, firstly, why are you here? Clara, Clara, what's happening? Um. Uh. You, you've just stopped. Oh, no, wait, you've started again. His message changed. He's saying something different. He's saying... What? 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 He's saying... The chamber will open tonight. Clara, now the ghosts are out. Go to the Faraday cage. They won't be able to get you in there. Oh, there's a problem. Problem? What problem? Oh, really? Because everything else is going so smoothly. The phone signal won't be able to get through. What you're going to have to do? I know. Put the phone outside, and you can watch it through the little round porthole. And when you see it ringing, if it is safe to do so, go out and answer it. Okay, well, how long are you going to... Clara, listen to me. Don't let that phone out of your sight. I need to be able to reach you. I need to know everything my ghost does. Do you understand? I'll come back for you. I swear. <laughs> 